Hello and welcome to the best of gaming number one. This is Oblivion, The Elder Scrolls 4. Um, and this is the Dark Brotherhood mission. I can't remember what name it is, but basically you have to go into a party and kill everyone without anyone seeing what you're doing. Now, in this series, well, I say this series is not really a series so much as I'm going to be recording videos and posting it under the tag of um, Best of Gaming. Basically, what's going to happen is. Yeah, sure, dude. Now, um, basically, I'm just going to be putting out another tag of best gaming. Um, basically, the thing I like about this game compared to Skyrim is the load time is amazing. I mean, I played Skyrim first. My friend played Oblivion before Skyrim and but prefers Oblivion overall. I'm more of a Skyrim type, but I'm not sure if that's just because I played it first. But I do really appreciate this kind of thing. The storylines are amazing in this. And basically, I'm... I'm going to try and trick these people here. I'm going to say my baby is sick and we are so poor. I want to find the gold as much as anyone, but you need it so much more than I do. Yeah, okay, right. So, first of all, what I want to be doing is I want to be making these people friendly towards me. So the best way to do that is, first of all, to check what they like. So this woman likes admire and joke. I want to be using these this big wheel on admire and joke and as small as I can on boast and coerce. And the reason I'm doing this is basically at the end you can get the second to last person to murder the, um, well, when it's down to two people you can get them to kill each other basically. Alright, so there, my disposition is at 81, that's max for her. So let's get a quick bit of info on the other guests. Personally, I think she's a little floozy. She's been eyeing young Primo Antonius, probably smells his wealth. Okay, so that's Stervacy. That's right, it's a Breton name. I'll have you know that the Teeths are one of High Rock's oldest and most respected noble family. Well, I don't really have much time for you, to be honest. You can oh, go fuck yourself. I find his entire manner offensive. Why, just before you got here, you told me the most off-colour joke about an Argonian maid. <laughs> okay. Well, if I can be perfectly honest with you, I find Neville quite attractive. Red guards are so... exotic. Don't you think? It's obvious that young Primo comes from wealth. Well, I really hope for Neville's sake he doesn't end up going with this woman. I have a good idea where that chest might be. That gold is as good as mine. Okay. Right. Let's go and talk to... I can't quite decide where I should look. I'll go and talk to this so guy here first. Primo Antonius. People of my station are not accustomed to waiting. Okay, so first thing we want to do is get his disposition up. That goes down, that goes down, that goes up, and that goes up. So joke and coerce is the way to go. So 
So, basically, you can do this really quite quickly. So, disposition 78, disposition max. Okay. Okay, so. Apparently, the poor old woman thinks she's more well to do family. Truth is, I have servants with more nobility in their blood than her. <laughs> Nels is in trouble. He doesn't even try to hide that fact. But what else is he? When the liquor is dry, what remains of the man? I think Nels drinks to forget, thinking about some tragedy in his life. He plays the buffoon that I sense. Oh, poor him. He's gonna die. Too mean from the game before this to the game after this. Okay. Okay. Right. Oh, I'm Joe Basin. What I mean to say is, before you arrive, we all just sort of glanced around a bit. Now that we're all officially here, we can look in earnest. Okay, once all again. Right. That's just, I won't really tell me. I didn't pay any attention there, sorry. Right, so that's down, that's up, that's down, and that's up. So I admire. And coerce is what she likes. I've increased my speech craft quite a bit. Oh shut up. I hate it when people start talking like that. They stole our land. Fuck off. Alright, so she should go. She should go running up to the upstairs um, bedrooms. I'm gonna follow her up there, and then once I've killed her, I'm gonna come down and talk to everyone else. Um, basically, this episode's gonna run a little longer than my usual ones. Purely because this is quite an interesting scene. Can I just say that there's only you and a bunch of guys here? Your speech pattern got one fucked up there. Dark elf in the world. And now there's one less person to find the gold as well. It's a good day, don't you think? 
you think Nels might be the killer? He plays the buffoon, but it could all be that. He's an old, and they're such a savage, uncivilized people. Neville has a strong sense of justice, I can tell. If we find out who the killer is, he'll take care of things, if you know what I mean. I worry about the boy. What if the killer is after money? Primo is quite wealthy. He could be the next victim. Okay. You'll be smart to stay with the rest of the group. It's just not safe for them wandering off alone with a killer on the loose. Oh, there's someone else there. Oh, hello. Hello, Neville. Someone's been killed, and as far as I'm concerned, you're one of the prime suspects. You watch yourself. Sure, man. Alright, now let's make you. That'd be good. That's pretty good. Whatever up, you want. Up, no down, matter. down. Okay. No, I doubt. You're full of it. I'm not about to. Good one. I accept. I have no. I don't be. Sure, that's good. Sure. Whatever you. That's it. Don't make me laugh. No. I. That's it. You're a big. No, I'm not. You're full of it. Block. No, I'm not buying that one. All right, I get it. I was in the Legion for a great many years. Like <sighs> I saw a lot of horrible things, including the murders of children. It made no sense then, it makes no sense now. But don't you worry. I vow to bring the Legion's killer to justice. Sure, man. She's afraid for good reason. If the killer strikes again, they may very well take an easy target like Matilda. She needn't worry. I'm a trace. With 20 years of experience dealing with situations like this, on my honor, this killer will be caught and dealt with. Lords are raised to be cold-blooded killers. Don't take your eyes off Nels if you value your life. I'll bet anything you know, murder. I'm a red guard. But I've never actually been to Hammerfell. I was born here in Syria. My family has been in the region for three generations. To be honest, my instincts tell me the kid isn't the killer. Sure, he's a bit obnoxious, but that doesn't make the table of birth. You'd be smart to stay with the rest of the group. Just not stay to go one Okay, right. Let's go and talk to the other guys first. Is that why someone invited us here? Someone's been murdered. By Ismir's beard. I need a drink. <laughs> I like this man. He is actually quite don't, cool. You don't be not bad. <laughs> yeah, well, you're sure that yeah, um, you're a big fan. Well, you not I accept. I have um your yes, yeah, yeah. That's a blah yeah. I um I feel really bad for this dude, I really do. She's upset about the murder, but there's something else. It's almost like she's glad there's less competition for the gold. Greedy old bat. Ah, don't let the name fool you. I had a bit too much need a few years back, and there was this tavern wench. Anyway, <laughs> call me Nell. I really have to wonder where Nettle was. Someone was getting slaughtered just a few rooms away. Maybe he was busy looking for the chest of gold. Maybe he was right next to the victim with his hand on the hilt of a dagger. Think about it. Whoever the killer is will have to be strong and quick. Now, I'm not saying Primo is our murderer, but you have to admit it's at least possible. Okay. You'd be smart to stay with the rest of the group. It's just not safe to go wandering off So let's go and talk to Primo one last time before we kill someone else. Beginning to get a bad feeling about all of this. I'd leave right now if I could. With the money, it's nothing to me. I just thought it would be fun. Who? Who among us is vile enough to take the life of such a beautiful, precious creature? If I find out who did this, they will pay with their life! 
Now that someone's been killed, Matilda may be a little frightened for her own safety. She's still more concerned with finding the hidden gold. Matilda claims to be from one of the High Rock's most distinguished noble families. But I have a feeling that fortune has long been squandered. Before the body turned up, I got the sense that Nels was a bit of a drunk. But he seems truly unnerved now and is drinking rather excessively. Neville seems different now that someone has been killed. More alert, more aware. Something tells me he's not going to take all of this lying down. He's a trained soldier after all. I bet if anyone can figure out what's going on here, it will be him. Alright, so logic dictates that the next person we should kill is Neville. Everyone carries on telling you that it's not safe to go alone in the house. Who the hell would sleep at a time like this? Anyway. There we go. I've been trying to figure out who our host might be. With two people dead, it almost seems like he set this party up just to kill us all. Two people dead, yet Nell still lives. I don't think that's a coincidence. Nor it's a savage born to kill. I just know he did it. Why would one of us kill Nell? What if we try to get the rest of us? You'll protect me, won't you? If I may confide in you, dear friend. I'm very worried about the poor boy. The trauma of murder. It could scar him for life. He deserves better. Don't go far. Now, as soon as, as, soon as she's so worried about Nell, about I want to leave Primo and her till the last one. Find comfort there, you see. I'll be honest, friend. I don't know what to think about Matilda. Yeah, she seems frightened, but she's also still alive. Why wasn't she killed? She may look old and weak, but that's never stopped a murderer before, has it? Don't doubt for a second that she couldn't be the killer. You want to know how I really feel about Neville's death? I'm afraid. I may hate the Imperial Legion, but its members are trained warriors. Neville was probably the most capable fighter among us, yet he was cut down silently, just a few rooms away. I fear one of us is not fully here. <laughs> uh. This isn't the work of some greedy house guest. There's an assassin among us. You mark my words. We must watch ourselves at every step. Let me ask you something, friend. Why is Primo even here? The rest of us need the money. His family is wealthy beyond measure. Maybe he was bored. Or maybe he just wanted to do some slumming. Or maybe he's a trained assassin, hired to kill us all, one by one. Sound crazy? Well, these are crazy times, my friend. Everyone is so suspicious of one another, and yet no one wants to do anything about it. into my own hands. The more annoying Matilda becomes. She's watching over me like some kind of worried grandmother. If the killer strikes again, he will do me a favor and take her out next. To be honest, I'm not sure if I trust him. He's a hard drinker, but there's something more. Something in his eyes. Hard. Calculated. Truly worried. Neville was a strong and capable man, a soldier of twenty years. The rest of us will be easy prey for the killer now. All right. At this point, I'm going to just quickly um, check something, and I apologize for this. Um, I think it's possible to get Primo to kill 
um, Matilde, but if it isn't, well, I'll just save it and then, because I want to show you guys someone killing someone else. Um, so, you know. Ah, crap. So many people dead. <gasps> oh, thank goodness it's you, sweetie. Please don't want it too far away. I feel safe with you. So, Melvin's dead. I don't condone murder, of course, but I can't say he'll be missed. As a rule, I find Nords rather vulgar. Oh my heavens. Primo must be the killer. I I never thought it could be him. Please, please. You've got to protect me from him. So Where are you going? Dear friend, three of the guests have been killed. You and I, we must stay close. Band together for mutual protection. I was thinking. Maybe Nels have the chest of gold and one of the others killed him for it. We've got to be careful, my friend, or we could be next. It's her. Don't you see? She's the only one left. The only one <laughs> that's alive. Except for me. We've got to get her before she can get us. Do you understand? Alright. So let's see this amazing thing here. <laughs> Yo, Primo. Guess what, motherfucker? All of our guests are now dead, and no one knew I was the killer. I must now return to the sanctuary and speak with Achiever to receive my reward and bonus. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is who done it. The quest from Oblivion that I am making the first of my best ofs. Because, well, it really is one of the best things I have ever played. So, leaving it where we started outside the house, no end this. If you like this video and would like to see videos, some of the best one, please subscribe. When number two comes out the annotation will be in the top right until then look out for it because it'll be coming um as soon as i find a number two i don't actually have one in mind at a minute so and my other videos if you want to check them out great um so until next time folks see ya